Hey lovelies, it's it's Ekpe here, the very cute it's it's Ekpe. And you guys, today today's video is not gonna be the regular video. Um, so in today's video, I just want to have a heart to heart talk with you guys. Like, um, I just want to talk. I just want to talk all day and then just cry and sleep and wake up and feel good. <laughs> if that's actually possible a lot has been going on a lot has been happening and i just feel like it's i just feel like i'm beginning to explode you know little by little from the inside and um it is not good for me it's not good for the people around me and i just decided to you know turn on my camera and just talk to someone i know someone is listening to me i know you are listening to me so please just listen to me till the very end because i'm just gonna be talking 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 doing a whole lot of talking i just want to talk to you guys because i don't want to just disappear you know and just go off without talking to you guys about what's happening to me about what i'm going through and then just reappear all of a sudden so i need to talk to you guys i need you guys to understand what is happening and i really hope you guys do understand me so i'm just going to be highlighting and um you know talking about things that have just been going on around me recently and um where do i even start from like <laughs> i don't even know where to start from okay let's start from here um when i mean here i mean youtube so before youtube i've um always been this regular kind of girl who has you know few families and loved ones and friends and who loves to mind her business like i mind my business for a living i'm not even gonna lie i know how to mind my business and um i love to be in my space like when i mean my space I love to be in my house and I love to be around my family, you know, my kids and my husband. That alone is very okay for me. I don't really call friends, like I don't really make calls. I hardly really chat, you know. I'm just always this private kind of girl. You can hardly know anything about me. I mean, something can happen to me and you won't even know it. You might, you might be living together and you won't even know what is happening to me i'm that kind of person because i just feel like you know i don't like to bug people with my problems i like to like figure out my problems on my own try and solve things on my own you know without bugging anybody at all and you know coming to youtube has really changed that a whole lot it has changed a whole lot about me i'm beginning to be a little bit more open um don't get me wrong i'm a very jovial person i'm very lively i mean i'm the life of the party but when i want to like bring out that other side of me it can be really draining on me and people around me yes um before i continue so this is my very first video for the year and I mean i just want to use this opportunity and wish you guys a happy new year and i pray that everything you've set out to accomplish this year it is going to come to pass you are going to accomplish it and more in jesus name amen so there's a whole lot that comes from being a youtuber you know a content creator and um it is not easy it's not easy and let me just put it out here that youtube it's it's not for the faint hearted i mean <laughs> you have to really work hard honestly you really really have to work hard and um i started this youtube because i love talking i mean i love to listen to other people's opinion about life and so many other things in general one day i just thought to myself it's as i did i didn't even know that youtube used to pay i'm not even gonna lie i didn't know that youtube used to pay so i just thought okay i could just talk 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 and just you know put it out there and people will just give their opinions on what they think and then you know we'll just start chatting and all of that so that was one of the reasons why i started my youtube career because i love talking 
I love talking to people and I know I'm talking to you and you are listening to me. So like I said, I told myself I can do this, but I never really had the time. I never really had the chance, you know, to start until I relocated to Port Harcourt and then boom, <laughs> my best friend, Dinah, she gave me the spotlight. I mean, <laughs> 85 if not 90 percent of you guys here know me through her channel and i'm really 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 grateful for that like i don't know how to express my gratitude and i don't think i would have actually been able to do this on my own like you know knowing a whole lot of things i know now about youtube because before i just feel okay just post videos and that's it <laughs> a whole lot of people think the same way you know they just think you just post a video and that's it but it's not like that you know it's challenging so eventually i started my youtube channel on the 18th of october last year and i mean since that time till now i've been monetized i've um I've gotten over 4,500 subscribers and we are now way to 5,000 subscribers. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Like, I mean, I couldn't and I wouldn't have achieved this, all of this, without you guys, without your support, without your love. And um, I, I'm really grateful, honestly. I'm really, really grateful. I'm really thankful. Like I said, I don't know how to express my gratitude to you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm actually grateful for the whole YouTube experience and everything. But most times, it can be very overwhelming. It can be quite stressful, you know. It can be quite draining. Just like every other work profession, you know. You have to work hard and... Um, other work professions who can be quite draining very nice you know sometimes it's quite draining it's quite tiring you know if you're a doctor if you're a lawyer you know an engineer there are some days that you just wake up and feel like i'm not doing this anymore i can't do this again but other days you wake up and you're so excited to go to work you know and all of that some days you wake up and you're not excited to go to work that's how youtube is sometimes you're, you wake up and you're excited to pick up your camera and film and some days you're not you're just like you know what please i can't do this again and that being said um youtube you need to really crack your head you know to create content and before now like before i joined youtube i honestly never thought that content creators used to run out of content i i never knew i didn't know that content creators run out of content and um i remember running to one of my friends you know like tonaria she's also a youtuber here you know i was talking to her i'm like is it normal for people to run out of content because i see people post like videos every three three two two three three days you know how are they doing it how are they getting content and then she was like, yeah, that is very normal. Like, I shouldn't beat myself up. That is very normal because, you know, when I started, I feel like, okay, I should post a video at least three times in a week. I know. <laughs> oh, my God. But, um, it is not easy. It's not easy at all. So, like I said, I'm grateful for the whole YouTube experience. But if it's going to cost me my safety, you know, my mental health, my sanity, then I think I need to take a step backwards and not stress myself out, you know, just chill a bit and do the needful. You know, New Year and my anniversary just passed. And normally I should have picked up my phone to vlog, you know, showing you guys how I spent my New Year and how i celebrated my fifth year anniversary but on more <laughs> i chose to live in the moment i chose to enjoy the moment in my family and um, just enjoy myself and not worry about editing and you know carrying my phone in people's faces up and down although i vlogged a bit but for the most part, I just wanted to be with my family and just enjoy 
every bit of it and um to be honest i felt good it feels so good <laughs> and then i remember last year you know december i was telling myself that this year i have to be consistent and you know what <laughs> i'm going to be consistent by god's grace and that's on period yes you heard me i'm going to be consistent on these streets I'm not gonna let anything weigh me down i'm going to push myself harder to get to the goal i've set for myself this year concerning my youtube career because this is my career now so i'm going to have to push myself harder and harder and if i feel like i'm breaking down i break down and pick myself back up again that's it <laughs> so let's move on to the next issue and um I don't have a help anymore <laughs> i'm helpless yes i'm helpless it's just i my husband and my kids basically so apparently my help left um early this year like as a last week she left due to some health challenges she's been with me for the past two years and some months so we've been managing the health issue and all of that but i mean i couldn't manage it again she's someone's child so i told her that I feel like it's best for her to you know go back to her parents so her parents can look after her very well and she had to leave and my nanny also had to leave because she found another job you know where she stays where she's from rather and she was like she would prefer that someone to this one because she will have to stay with her mom and you know take care of her mom look after her mom and all of that so although she told me this before she started working for me as at i think she started working for me late september yeah that was when she started her work she told me about this high job that she'll be resuming january and i was like okay fine because by then i was desperately in need of help so i told her hopefully i should be able to get someone else to replace you before you know you leave and all of that but I couldn't get someone not because i didn't want to but because um i just felt like okay maybe she might change her mind eventually and you know i just felt really comfortable with her and um i didn't just want to you know just think about her living just that yes but it's reality now she's gone and my help is gone but that being said my mom actually found someone else for me and i'm not even gonna lie it's been quite stressful really 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 stressful because you know when you get somebody new showing the person around the house showing the person how things are done in your house how you want things to be done and how you like things to be done can be quite draining school has begun and i basically do everything in the house even with my new help because she's just trying to find her way around the house thankfully my husband does pick up and drop off so that is off my chest <laughs> but I'm still looking for another help just to you know assist with some other things in the house so um, that being said we've actually come to the end of this video <laughs> I know, I know, I know it's not what you were expecting. <laughs> We've actually come to the end of this video and I just want to tell you thank you for listening to me talk or rant or I don't know. But thank you for just watching me. Thank you for just staring at my cute face. Thank you for sticking by me. Thank you for, you know, coming back to watch my video again. Thank you for everything and please if you have not subscribed do well to click that subscribe button like comment and share this video and um let me know if you know your help returned after the festive period after the break if she returned or if she did not return how are you coping you know how are you find your way around how is it for you guys because um, waking up early is always a struggle for me being that i'm not even a morning person yes i can stay up all night but once i sleep at night 
I wake up really 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 late yes because I don't sleep early at night so I always have to struggle waking up early but I'll be fine I mean I'm doing it for my kids so if you have help I mean good for you you don't know what the Lord has done for you <laughs> but if you don't have a help please let me know how you're coping probably perhaps i might read a comment and just you know pick one or two from there and be able to adjust myself but that aside like i said earlier we've come to the end of this video please do well to like subscribe and share this video to someone who needs to hear this and um hopefully 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 i'll see you guys in my next video for now stay safe take care and bye